Good morning. Today we're going to look at Psalm 105, and we're going to look at a couple of different verses. And Psalm 105 is talking about the eternal faithfulness of God. And we need, if we realize God is faithful, and we need to experience that faithfulness today because of what's going on. So, verse 1, Oh, give thanks to the Lord, call upon His name, make known His deeds among the peoples. And then he says, Glory in His holy name, and let the hearts of those rejoice who seek the Lord. Seek the Lord and His strength, seek His face evermore. And realizing that He remembers His covenant that He made with us. When I look at this particular psalm, and I start looking at these things, the first verse talks about us praying, calling out to the Lord, and asking Him for whatever's going on and what the needs that we have in our lives. But then he also comes down and he says that we are to seek the Lord and seek His face. We saw when Jesus wrote in Matthew, uh, when He says, Ask and it shall be given unto you. Seek and you shall find. Knock and it shall be opened unto you. What we're looking at seeking is diligently searching for something. Why is it you always find the object you've misplaced the last place you look? Think about that. Searching for knowledge of the Lord through His Word is what we need to do. Searching in prayer that we may find out how we are to follow Him. Searching for the wisdom from above that we can use to share with others around us. And searching for ways to serve the Lord. Diligently we need to do that. We search for nuggets of gold in the Scripture to strengthen our walk with Him. Let me encourage you to be daily in the Word and there's so many Bible helps today that you can get online that it will help you through the power of the Holy Spirit understand the Word. So we're looking at this and I'm thinking, seeking the Lord. I find seeking God to be rewarding, to be comforting, and encouraging. When I'm down and out, I seek the Word of God to be lifted up. I enjoy watching music videos of songs that encourage and strengthen every day, that speak to my heart. I find that as the opportunity arises, sharing my faith also has a tremendous effect on my day. I went to the grocery store a couple of days ago, and these ladies came by, and she had, one of them had a t-shirt on about, you know, Jesus is everything. And I just said, He is, and He's the solid rock on which we stand. And both of those ladies lit up and said, hey, that is right, that's awesome. And so in a day and time like this, we need to do encouraging things like that. So we seek Jesus, and it gives us a desire to live more for Him every single day. Your quiet time is essential in the morning. You find the strength for the day. So my encouragement is spend time seeking Him. Then you will realize that He came, that you might have life and you might have it more abundantly. Because as it says in Psalms 105, He remembers His covenant that He made with us forever.